we as humans are capable of limitless potential and while there are numerous obstacles that can hinder us towards our goals we have to stand in awe of one of the biggest obstacles that we invariably face ourselves Today's video is on why gear doesn't matter, why done is better than perfect, and how to do more with less. And I'm not going to deny that gear does make things better and convenient. A 4K video will look better than a 720p. A video which is better lit will be more pleasing than a video which is not. A scenic place like this will always be better than a room. But you have to understand by no stretch to any of these things contribute towards content let alone good content In fact I can make the argument that gear makes it difficult sometimes to shoot one of the biggest issues that face especially in a place like India is permission combined that with the fact that you become so much more visible with the gear on you that you're always on the lookout for authorities uh, whether you're invading private or personal space always told that you cannot shoot here or that the camera is not allowed the resultant of that has made me really appreciate this nifty device the only issue with this is that the quality of this might not match the beast but i'd rather have an avid shot that conveys a story than a 4k shot that doesn't exist Now, I'm not advocating that you shoot everything on the phone. But my point is that done is better than perfect because more often than not, perfect never gets anything done. What we as creators are fundamentally trying to do is to create and to create good. And to create good, you need to distinguish it from the bad. And I think through the process of doing and just doing, you can better understand that. One of our best teachers will always be our mistakes. There's no question about it. And let's face it, making mistakes is going to be messy, and it will be discouraging to some. Honestly, I wouldn't be able to make this vlog if I hadn't made all the vlogs I have till date. Some vlogs taught me scripting, some lighting, some audio, some design, and some me. Now, of course, you can learn by reading and watching, but by being the primary stakeholder of your own mistake, you'll retain them better. At the end of the day, failure is instructive. And that's what this process is. Instructive. It's not just some empty timeline. It'll make you persevere so that you can learn those tiny lessons that you need to learn along the way to create good. And to create good, you need insights. And to gain valuable insights, you need to document. Document your practice, document your mistakes, document your time. And this process will take time. It will take time. There will be days that just won't be it. You'll have downs like never before, and it's not going to be easy. The good news is that you don't need a lot to get through this. All you need is to persevere and to have patience. That's it. And I think here's where done really triumphs so over perfect. Because while perfect might be a dream, and it's good to aspire for that, done and making mistakes is human. Which brings me to our limitless potential. We humans might not be much. but we can do a lot with quite little actually and that's where i want to leave you at do more with less it's an evolving concept but so are we that's where i'll want your help to create and contribute towards this process because gear doesn't matter you do if there are any specific questions you have regarding this you can comment below or dm me on instagram this hopefully helps you and it definitely helps me because your question might just become a topic for me because life is limitless that way